on me. Lead. Lead. This blowhawk ain't working out on TV. Hey, welcome to the Chill Spot. I'm Corinne. And I'm Christy today. Yay! She's back I'm with back. us again. She's back. Is that a good thing or a bad thing? Oh, it's probably a really bad thing. So, you yeah. Think? You kind of remind me of that one movie where he's like busting through the door and it's like, I'm back. Or here's Johnny. Oh, The Shining? Yeah, The Shining. Because oh, I never yeah. know who you're going to be on the show. Yeah. Well, <laughs> earlier I was riding my hot wheels through... <laughs> Lori and Lisa's house. So yeah, I mean, I could totally be in the shiny end. That's true. That is true. Yeah. So today we're going to talk about what's going to happen tomorrow. What's tomorrow? Tomorrow is ask a stupid question day. I have lots of stupid questions. <laughs> that does not surprise I me know. at all. Um, it gives you the opportunity to ask the things that you you have always been curious about, that you always wanted to know, but you're always afraid to ask. Because they're stupid. Because they're stupid. That's but right. you don't know the answer, so you want to know the answer. And exactly. Yeah. Exactly. This day was actually started in the 1980s. Um, there was a movement by teachers. And... When I was reading about it, it was just like, why would teachers promote a day like this when you're trying to get your students to be quiet in the right. classroom? But they felt it was a good way to get them to step out of their um, comfort zone. Absolutely. Yeah. So today on the chill spot with Chrissy is still here with me, right? You haven't left. I'll let you know if anything changes. <laughs> Because that's my stupid question. I'm there you make, go. I is make, this Christy? I get it. I get it. I want to make sure it anytime. that you're, I, you know. you're here with oh, me. Oh, I understand. So we're going to celebrate this day. Um, we challenge you to call NACA. Ask that question um, that you've always wanted to know about our association, about the board members, about the staff members, about 12, one of the 12 personalities that she has. If you have a question um, for Gary about how he does the filming or anything, <laughs> um, please reach out to us because, you know, it's your day. Um, so think of your questions. If we do not have an answer for your question, we will do our best to um, to find that for you because it's all about you and we're here for you. I was going to say they should call Jeff and just keep Jeff busy on the phones. Which Jeff? Jeff Wellman. Yeah. That way. That would work. I mean, you know, I'd give him something to do other than look pretty. He could actually <laughs> be working on answering. I don't know if he knows all my personalities, so those questions might be hard for him to answer. Okay. Well, if he comes to me and says, Corinne, why did you say this? I'm What's say, Bud doing? Yeah, it was either Bud or it was Hilda. Well, what's or great Olga. is he's not going to know any of these people that work. For, That's you know, true. It's going to be. That's true. Do That's it. That's true. That's right. So I'm going to tell him, well, Jeff, that is not a stupid question. We just have to find out which and person. And it's your job to answer these <laughs> to questions. Answer the question. So um, reach out to us. Um, I know I sound like a broken record, but. Um, we don't know if there's a problem unless you bring the problem um, to us and um, let us find a solution to it. So um, have fun, and uh, we can't wait to see you on Monday. And remember, you matter. You matter.